fans, good afternoon to you. And here at the Purdy's World Sports Center in Worcester, we welcome you to another professional wrestling session. And we start this afternoon's proceedings with a lightweight contest of six five-minute rounds. Just one fall to decide between these two lightweights. Steve Gray of Peckham Southeast Land at 11 Stone, the British lightweight champion. There with the black trunks and silver boots, as always. And his opponent, who <laughs> walks out of that headlock nicely, his opponent, we've only seen a couple of times on television, but something really worth watching, this fellow, from Gloucester, Steve Speed. And with a name like Speed, as a lightweight, the physique that he's got, tremendous physique for a lightweight, as you can see there on the left. And he's got to be really speedy here this afternoon to stand up to the tremendous pace of his opponent, Gray. Remember, just one fall to decide this six-round contest. Three. Wrestle off. taken didn't bother to finish the cartwheel but got the hands down well again Gray turns him on a head quick head mare there referee Jeff K of Hull in charge of this one side headlock now speed and tack quick leg dive there by speed going for the figure four leg lock but hasn't really got it now couldn't hold it full nelson speed you can see the colossal shoulders on this man steve speed really tremendous physique for lightweight he really is arm stretch and he must not fall for this gray is trying to make <laughs> yes <laughs> he nearly always do eventually nice roll but he hasn't got enough room Down, take his man with a double leg Nelson at speed. Remember, one fall contest, that's all he needs is one fall. Steve Gray is only going to make one mistake, and probably he'll be defending his title against this fella one of these days. Side head chance for Steve Speed. Yes, shades of the Royal Brothers. Some of their specialty moves. Vic Faulkner is still wrestling, of course, still operates that one pretty often. Lovely to see. Oh, gets a count of two. Yeah, can't get anywhere with that, so release. And that's the way out of it. Gray shows us. The way he switches the attack is so fast. But speed pretty quick too. Living up to his name there. Oh, wouldn't Steve Speed love to win this one against the champion at lightweight, the British champion? He really would put in a good case for a, a possible chance of the belt if he won this one here this afternoon. Double wrist lock, speed. 15 seconds to go in this first round. Of six. And Gray in trouble, but not for long, because the bell will help him in about three seconds. Now 
Can you get that applause from a packed capacity crowd here at the Purdyswell Sports Centre in Worcester? Great applause for a great first round by this man, the champion at lightweight, Steve Gray of South East London, Peckham, 11 stone. And his opponent doing very well in that first round. Let's hope he can keep it up against the colossal pace and experience of this man. Seconds away, round two. Round two, five to go. No score because one fall decides this contest. The first fall is the one that matters here. Yes, we're going to see more of this speed. Steve Speed, he really is quite something. He's giving Gray a little bit of trouble here. I think Gray will have to pull out a lot of stops to get rid of him. There's the drop kick that'll slow him a bit. Left foot dead right. Nice, nice counter. <laughs> but even in a double-handed wrist lever with speed had Gray brings the feet around to drop kick him away. Oh, this tremendous, colossal pace of these two fellows. Marvelous. Steve Speed suffering from a slight nosebleed already, but that won't worry him, I don't suppose. Probably hasn't even noticed it. Robert Gray. It's a bit of uh, blood showing up there, but all coming from a S Steve Speed's nose. <laughs> Walked into that back to the bow there. A little more treatment to the face by Gray. Perfectly legal. None of this part of the same move. the way Gray looks up at the referee to say I'm not doing anything wrong <laughs> why are you watching me so closely there's the counter by speed nearly made it aiming for the backhand oh no 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 and a straight arm left attempt by speed here Yes, the forearm stops him. Referee just checking the nose there. Uh, it's okay. He says no, no problem. Nice here with the top double leg, Nelson to speed two. Oh, the referee's hand was halfway down for the count of three. There it was the nearest thing for Gray. Follow up drop kick, nice work. Gray, you need a little tiny bit less confident now. Full Nelson, speed. Gray? This, this follow from Gloucester really is a fast mover. Really living up to his name. Yes, <laughs> he went one too many times. One, two, three. Going in fast with the headbutt, Gray. Oh, this is the kind of wrestling that so many people really like. It's a fast moving craft. Showing skill by both men. Holding press, Gray, speed in trouble. A gets it as early as round two. Gray gets it. Unfortunate for Steve Speed, but we're going to see much more of him in the future, that's for sure. Just four minutes, 20 seconds in a round two. Gray the winner by the one four required.
And in Crabtree. four minutes, 20 seconds of round two, for a very hard fought contest, the winner, Steve Gray. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your appreciation for the blue corner from Gloucester, Steve Speed. <laughs>